I am joining Tina Ekman from Black Magic Design, who had a slew of announcements today. I think it just blew the lid off of the Las Vegas Convention Center here. Hi, Sue Lawson here, NAB 2015 with BSVP on site. One of the big announcements was the little addition to the family, which is the Ursa Mini. Oh, tell me, show me, just walk us through. Yeah, so we'll, really quickly we'll just discuss the fact that we have the Ursa, and you know a lot of people liked the, the form factor of it, but they wanted something a little bit smaller, a little more compact. So our answer to that was the Ursa Mini. And it is just that. It's a smaller camera. It's got a, a different form factor for sure. And if you turn around, you can immediately start to see some of the differences with the camera. We've we dropped some of the screens, so we have uh, no audio meters on this side, for example. And this handle actually ships with the camera right here. Which is amazing. Yeah, so you can, it's really So you've got your side pistol grip. Right, you've got the side pistol grip, but obviously there's options. As usual, we have a way of working around that. But you still have the full, the connections that you need for professional work, obviously. So you've got your SDI and your power here for your viewfinder. You've got 12 gig SDI out, reference time code in, power. We work with the same power of batteries rather that we do with the Ursa, so IDX power plates, all that's the same as on the other Ursa as well. This time we have a five inch fly out screen as well. So you can get just you know great images if you're not using the new electronic viewfinder that we'll talk about in a second. Still works with CFast cards. USB port moved up here now, so you can really easily update your camera as well. And the way we're displaying it here is we've got, we're showing the shoulder mount, which is an optional accessory. For $395, you get the quick release shoulder mount and a handle for the top that you can pull off, and then the extension rod down here so that you can put your um, trigger grip down here as well and really use it as a great shoulder mount camera. You can also add the electronic viewfinder which is what works for both Ursas. It's the Ursa EVF, and it's a beautiful precision glass EVF with an OLED display, 1920 by 1080. You've actually got focus guides on the side so that you can make sure that you're really focusing your image correctly. And I think that customers are just going to love it. Left eye, right eye, you know, tally light on the front so you know you're recording beautiful stuff. The major difference, other than the, the obvious size difference from this Ursa, is this one is not customer upgradable. But we have a variety of flavors for this camera. So, of course, EF and PL, but we also announced a new sensor. So this camera will come in the, the 4.0 sensor. So it's got the 12 stops, and it goes up to 60 frames rolling shutter, 30 frames global shutter, or you can upgrade to the brand new 4.6 sensor, which is 15 stops of dynamic range for just outstanding color. And that one on this camera, again, goes to 60 frames rolling shutter or 30 frames global. So your imagery is going to be incredible. Out of outstanding, it. outstanding. Yes, very much. So, so great things here from Blackmagic Design. Um, all information on this can be found, of course, on their website, blackmagicdesign.com. Sue Lawson for BSVP on site here at NAB 2015 with the fabulous people at Blackmagic Design. Thank you from the production world for being so receptive to the needs of editors, shooters, producers, directors. I could go on and on and on, but I won't. Check out the website.